It was a top-seeded battle for the Division 5 Region 17 title as the number one seed Kirtland Hornets took on the number two seed South Range Raiders in a rematch of the 2020 Region 17 final. I'm Logan Batoski, and here are the game's highlights. The Hornets drove about an hour out to Niles McKinley High School's Bo Ryan Stadium on what was a chilly Saturday night. Both crowds packed the stands for this highly anticipated playoff matchup between the two highest ranked teams in all of Division 5. If you blinked, you might have missed the Hornets strike first, as on the second plate from scrimmage, Will Sale intercepts the pass and takes it 42 yards for the pick six and another Kirtland defense pizza party, giving them an early 7-0 lead. On the next drive, South Range converts on fourth down as Billy Screepak finds Connor Jones for a 16-yard touchdown to tie the game at seven. After that, Ramon Lascano connects with Gage Sullivan for a 15-yard gain. A few plays later, Mason Russ plows into the end zone for a two-yard touchdown and a 14-7 Kirtland lead through one. In the second, Brennan Bro chases down Screepak for a TFL. Then, Scott Hamer forces a fumble, but the Raiders maintain possession. After a South Range punt, on the next play from scrimmage, Tommy Goblin turns on the afterburners and keeps his balance for a 64-yard touchdown run, which put the Hornets up 21-7. After that, Philip Laverde and Joseph Coleman team up for the TFL. On the ensuing drive, Gage Sullivan collects the catch and run for a 22-yard gain. A couple of plays later, some craziness ensues. Laverde gets the carry and fumbles, which is recovered by South Range. The Hornets then force another fumble, which the Raiders recover and return for a short gain. Raiders can't capitalize on the turnover as Gogolin intercepts this pass to end the half with Kirtland leading 21-7. to Up in the third, the Hornets take more than nine minutes off the clock and end the drive with a one-yard touchdown run by Russ, extending their lead to 28-7. But South Range didn't give up as Dylan Dominguez follows his blocks for a 65-yard kick return. Then, Laverde and Russ drive Screepak back for a 13-yard loss. Kirtland led 28-7 through three. In the fourth, Johnny Raguse kicks a 31-yard field goal to grow the Hornet lead to 31-7. On the ensuing possession, Screepak sprints down the field for a 37-yard touchdown run. A successful two-point conversion cut the Kirkland lead to 31 to 15. Then a unique play as the South Range onside kick spirals backwards and stops. After draining some more clock on fourth down, Moscano finds Sullivan for the incredible leaping catch and 17-yard touchdown, giving Kirkland a 38 to 15 lead. And that was the final score as the Hornets took the field to celebrate the victory. But this celebration didn't end without some hardware. Kirkland raises its 10th regional championship trophy in 11 seasons. Just tremendous. The Hornets take the rematch and extend the nation's longest active high school football winning streak to 54 games in a row defeating South Range 38 to 15. The game stats are now scrolling down your screen as Kirtland is now tied for the second longest winning streak in OHSAA history. Up next, the Hornets will play for their 10th state championship appearance in 11 seasons as they will take on the Region 18 champion Ottawa Glandorf Titans. The game will take place on Saturday, November 27th at Clyde High School's Joe and Sharon Wilson Field at 7 p.m. Thank you for watching and go Hornets!